To pay your creditors and vendors by exporting the transactions and uploading them to your bank for direct deposits, navigate to Accounts Payable Electronic Transfer. You will then be presented with the following screen. From here you can filter down to select certain invoices only for payment. For example, you can choose to select by a creditor. Or you can enter in a date, range of dates or a range of transactions or by due date if due date is being entered on invoice entry. You can also select to send remittances as part of this process and you can also select certain batches if batch entry is being used. You should also select the correct bank account which is being used as part of the payment process. The data process will be the date that the payments will be made on the bank. The data process will be what will be shown on the bank statement and will also be visible in the bank reconciliation when you begin the bank reconciliation process. When you're ready to continue with payment once you've selected which transactions you wish to pay or by default bring in all transactions by just clicking OK, you will then be presented with the screen selecting all invoices that have been entered that are outstanding for payment. From here we can look at our search criteria by current period, future period or all period or we can look at the posting period, current or future. From here you can choose to tick the whole column or we can select hold all down below. If we select hold all it will hold all payments which will allow you to individually mark payments which you want to pay. You can also choose to alter the amount to pay by reducing the amount to pay in the amount to pay column. Once you've completed your changes select pay down below to proceed with the export which will be created on your desktop. This will also produce your export report and it will also print a copy of remittances for your filing. Here is an example of the report that is produced and here is an example of the remittances that are produced. As part of the process of creating your BAX payment, if you wish to create a draft report, you can do so by clicking the draft print option down below. When you select this, it will ask if you would like to export any scanned copies of invoices and POs related to the transactions that have been highlighted for payment. When you select yes, these items will become available on your desktop in a folder called attachments from Midas. You will find the folder for the day in question and inside you will find any related scans of invoices and purchase orders. When you've completed all payments and are happy, you can just simply close the electronic transfer window.